Exalt you for your faithfulness and your love and kindness. Thank you so much for the gift of another beautiful week. Thank you, O oh God, for another beautiful day. Even as, O oh God, you start this working day with us, we pray that you have your way. Father, guide our steps, O oh God. Order our steps so that we will not miss our steps. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we commit ourselves into your hands today to have your way father you are too good how great is our god father you share your glory with no man that that is why oh god we submit to you and we pray that you have your way in our lives oh god in the mighty name of jesus we have prayed with thanksgiving we also pray that you have your way oh god in our meeting today oh god Speak to us, precious Holy Spirit, so we understand you better in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Welcome, I welcome you to the program. How do you understand the word of God? I believe you had a fruitful weekend. And for me, more about the about you as you send you media. You see, you say, Hey, now what you have here? Yeah, it's true. Me, who's who's so aba, who you in Shiram will be, and will be in see in Shiram. Hallelujah. If you are king, can someone say, Nyum Oha, and Nyum Oha? We'll take a devotional reading from Psalm 100. Hallelujah. It has five verses Psalm 100, 1 to 5. Let's hear the word of God. It is a psalm of thanksgiving. Shout to joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him singing with joy. Acknowledge that the Lord is God. He made us and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Brethren in the Lord, the Bible is telling us today to shout for joy. Why? Because God has given us our lives. God has blessed us with health. Even if you are sick this morning, we pray that the Lord himself will heal you so that we we all together can shout for joy. Hallelujah. It says that all the earth should shout for joy unto the Lord. I don't for Bible choy and they say, Yan fa enije in tiemo and fa my yan kopasa singing na mumbo seme rade. And po so baby na ya we ya and nasa kwadande bina da was swa. Or se fa bran or se mum ram in chemo ya so muni so mo do mumra na mes yamuna mamma humujie. And un tisa o nyamima ya humujia. Nature said, Ye yina ye. If God brings us out from our, our takes the burdens up that are upon us from our shoulders and gives us he gives us rest. When he does that to us, we also ought to praise him, we ought to adore him, we ought to shout for joy, we ought to worship the Lord with gladness. It say ye di enigie as sorry erade. As I say, a bad name near Tonyum, a catching sa fee twenty twenty year, Raduni edin a year, son say, near a try and wishing in nine mono, near me when you were woman so. God let us shout for joy and tell him that he has been so good unto us. Despite what is going on in the world, this pandemic that rises, goes down, and then rises again. Oh, no, these things the Lord has protected us. The Lord has delivered us. Therefore, we ought to praise him because he is our shield, our protector, our deliverer. Hallelujah. He is our healer. Papa, we bless you. We come before you singing with joy. Hallelujah. Verse 3 says that we should acknowledge the Lord that he is God. He made us and we are his. And we are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Brethren in the Lord. It is true that we need to acknowledge the Lord. Other for a no crane here, pa say, Yaditum praco say, a radi on one in your me, or ye yam me and pa, or no boy ye own. Ye an idea, ye an uncrawful, ye an in yang, ah, or no, or yang yang. Hallelujah. 
We are the sheep of his pasture. Hallelujah. We are his people. Brethren in the Lord, being a child of God is an honor, is a privilege. Hallelujah. A privilege it is a privilege. Hallelujah. Therefore, let's bow before him. Verse 4 says that enter his gates with thanksgiving, go into his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. Hallelujah. Even as we come before the throne room of grace, remember that Revelation 8 tells us that our prayers are mixed with incense and the angel of the angels of God, the angel who is in charge of our prayers, takes it to the altar of the Lord before the throne of God. Hallelujah. And so whatever prayer that you are lifting today unto the Lord, the Lord is receiving the prayers. He is receiving all of them and he will surely answer because the Bible says that he mixes our prayers with incense and then he takes it to the altar, the, 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 the altar of gold or the throne of gold and offers our sacrifice and presents our prayers before the Lord. Brethren, no prayer is in vain. Every prayer has an answer. Hallelujah. I don't for me empire bono or nyanko pabo for yes shan is so on ji empire no or j na bible say or the incense of fra who share a d summiting what you open who will ho na why was so sa a for we no na a more to me near what they know oh she a de good assassin or so i don't for no me so many me or tears here in who we serve a God who who lives, who we serve a living God, and He's a wonderful God. So the answer of our prayers is being poured on this earth. So if we bind here on earth, the Bible says that it is bound in heaven. When we we, we lose here on earth, it is loosed in heaven, and that is the reply that come. Hallelujah. Other for your church, your church, you Ya sunny in a soon to say, yeah, you better bomb pie enough to be a home wire, yeah, and now it's sunny a bayon so. And one time, my young fast, Dania, ye, ye, my young young coupon, Nijin Concrono, or see a shine, Napunumo, Napon can see a moon, Napaimon, so so young fire, ye, ye, and fan remo. For the Lord is good, his unfailing love continues forever, and his faithfulness continues to each generation. Other for your young coupon or yo. Na do ye ne dono e tu ntwa da na ni nukre di e nso so e ti mho da ne fi a wantu a tu a so e so e ku si a wantu a tu a so so an pansi yon hon se e fiti ti a o nyanko pon bo wi a si a o bo ni pano o nyanko pon nukre di e at na si a e nye ye ya brisu na nyame ni kwe di e be se sa the Lord has been faithful since creation. The Lord has been faithful even before we came to this earth. And he is still faithful and he never disappoints his people. May the Lord help us to trust in him and believe in him. May he help us also to be faithful unto him all the days of our lives. God richly bless us all as we wait for the coming of the Lord. We will continue to prepare ourselves with his word and prayer. Brethren, let's continue to pray for the nations of the world, for peace to prevail, for healing, for healing to be poured upon the nations. Remember that whatever we stand upon the word of God to, to, to say unto the Lord, that is what exactly he does for his children. May the Lord help us to be faithful children unto him. A homeboy ye and o nyan kopon or de brain. O nya min dum boy and as a yes wa me na ybe sure china a wa line is so may the Lord help us if Jesus has not come today we'll meet tomorrow on the line. Please stay safe. Please use your take the precautions that have been given unto us. Wash your hands frequently, use your sanitizers, wear your mask, and let's continue to pray that the Lord will see us through. God richly bless you. Have a fruitful day. Bye-bye. Otherwise, you
eye mpaibo onyame nka ye nyina ye ho e wo jesus dinimo bye bye